Welcome back to the Bean Shed, folks. Wanted to do something a little bit different today here, and that is a review of my favorite knife that I have in my personal collection. And it's from a brand or manufacturer that uh, you may not have heard of before. This is the Battle Horse Knives Explorer. Battle Horse Knives is out of Cambridge, Ohio. Nice, uh, you know, American-made company here. Smaller company, definitely not like a uh, Benchmade or a Spider Co. or anything like that, but they make extremely, extremely nice knives, very good quality, and I've been extremely happy with this so far. The first thing uh, that you see, of course, is the sheath. Um, this has been wet molded here a couple times by myself just to give it a little extra, you know, support there. And I've oiled it a few times, so it's kind of got nice and nice and dark. Uh, it came a little bit lighter than this, but really, really solid sheath uh, just to begin with. Obviously got the belt loop here as well. Solid piece, and it looks really, really nice on the hip. The knife itself, of course, is stunning as well, as you can see. Really, really solid O1 tool steel here for the blade, Scandi grind. Um, this particular model here that I got has green micarta scales, and these are bead blasted as opposed to polished, so it gives it a little bit, a little bit more of a rough finish. Kind of better for holding on, in my opinion. Not going to be all slippery like you know some kitchen knives are. Um, you got some brass pins in there, really, really nice looking, solid. And then, of course, a little lanyard hole there as well with a brass insert. All in all, again, this knife has treated me very, very well. I've used it for many things here from basic bush crafting to cutting cardboard for fire to making little spears and, I mean, everything in between. So it's really, really a pleasure to have used this knife. And uh, I've got a lot of, lot of good things to say about the company here as well. The blade length here is going to be about three and three quarters inches long. And the total length, of course, is about seven and three quarters inches long. Now, of course, this knife looks great, uh, but a knife is only as good as it's cut. So what we've got here is some basic uh, dirty cardboard, but cardboard nonetheless, medium thickness here. And as you can see, I mean, it just goes through there real easy. No, uh, no stoppage. No issues with that at all. Super, super clean, nice cuts. You can really, really get uh, get nice and detailed with this thing here. Very, very happy with, with this knife. Uh, the customer service for this company as well is, is just top notch, because again, they're, they're a smaller company. It's not gonna be some crazy huge corporate company that you're trying to deal with. And I mean, I got this custom made knife here I, I you know specified what kind of scales i want and what kind of pins and the steel and the grind and everything i got this custom knife with a sheath for 150 bucks and it came within one week of ordering it um really really happy with the company and the knife and uh th this is going to be an heirloom piece here which i will i will hand down to children one day or uh you know god willing they'll hand it down to their kids too and I mean, this is going to be in the family for a long time. So very, very happy with it. Would highly recommend. And if, uh, if you have any questions about my experience with Battle Horse Knives, please don't hesitate to reach out. Leave a comment here. And uh, thanks for watching. We'll see you on the next one.